But TK, mate, you've got a choice to start out of position one to go for $10,000 or to start out of position 19 and go for $19,000. Where are we going to come from, mate? You know, I, uh, I wish we had a little bit better racetrack. I know the heat probably got to this thing, but uh, I think I'm going to do the wise thing for the first time in my life and start up front and uh, take number one position and try to go for that 10 grand. So TK, ladies and gentlemen, is going to start out of position number one and that's where he's going to start from in tonight's day, Main. And as he said, it's probably the smartest decision he's made in a long time because he's going to come out of one. He's given up the 19 gram and he's going to go for 10. The field will start to line up in tonight's four wide. There's Maxie holding the flags up. How about it, ladies and gentlemen, making some noise for little Max Freeman down here on the infield. That's for you, Maxie. Hold those flags up, buddy. This is cool. This is Scott Daly's nephew. The drivers know that they need to go four wide now. And he's holding it up. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your starting field for tonight's A main of the Scott Darley Sprint Car Classic. You will notice that there is only three cars on that front row. It is called the Missing Man Formation and the drivers are paying their respect to Scott Darley. How about it, ladies and gentlemen, as they come out of turn four, let's make some noise and show your respect for Scott Darley and these drivers that are gonna contest 40 laps here at Valvoline Raceway. Trevor Green's leading the Aussie. 
racetrack in his previous races, and now he's weaving his way through the field. Steve Kinzer is your race leader. Cadings in second, Laney's third, Trevor Green in fourth. Oh wow, Trevor got off the gas big time. Have a look at Brad Sweet working his way through the field. Have a look at the 99 of Brad Sweet. He's coming. He's moving forward. He's got forward might on this race car. Race leader is going to be in lap traffic in a minute. Second place car, Tim Cading, has gone to the top. New race leader out of turn four, it's TK. The King goes back to second. Third is still playing out Brady. Trevor Green looking on the inside of him right now. So Katie still out in front. Gets caught up behind Red April, the King. He went to have a look on the inside. As a no, oh, no, Brad Sweet is going to be shown the noise flag. Well, it's not going to matter because he's not going to see it right now with the amount of back traffic going on out there right now. Race leader. Challenge for the leading one and two. The King went to the bottom. Katie hangs on to the race lead. Trevor Green trying to get past Blaney. Blaney trying to get past Brent April. No, Grant Anderson's there. Firing dive bombs underneath Anderson. Max is going to try and do the same. The two Ians, Ian Rowdle and Ian Madison. They're trying to come, they're trying to make it happen. They're trying to work it over. So Katie is still your race leader. The King of the Outlaws is in second spot. Third is Blayling, Trevor Green's in fourth. Fifth is Barry, sixth is Anderson, seventh is Max. Eighth is Loud and ninth is Ian Madsen. Tenth is Craig Kinzer. Eleventh is Brad Sweet. He's almost in the top ten. Loud and now, did he get caught up behind April? Madsen got in underneath him. Race leader is still TK, Tim Cady. 25 remaining in tonight's A-Main. Has the rubber gone down? Has rubber gone down yet? We haven't seen everybody run through any part of the track yet. TK, from Kinzer, from Blaney. Trevor Green still back there in four spot. Robbie Farr in fifth. Anderson is in six. Max is seven. Race leader comes out of turn four. TK, in the Sean Dyson Motorsport number 99. The King of the Outlaws still back there in second. Third is Blaney. Trevor Green gets a run out of turn two. Blaney puts the horsepower back down. Hangs on for third. You've got to love the caliber of these drivers. We've nearly got 20 laps non-stop. It's all happening here at Verbally Raceway. Caden's pulled away from the King. Blaney's still there in third spot. Farley tries to monster in underneath Greeny. Greeny hangs on to four. Now it's rubber down. You know why? There's no more dust. It's working for these guys. They're trying, but where is it all down? Who's going to find it the best and the fastest way around the racetrack? You've got to find it and make it work for you. TK is pulling away from the king, believe it or not. Third place is still Blaney. Then we go back to Trevor Green in fourth. Fifth is Robbie Farr. Ando, Darmsney, Madsen, Loudon, Kinzer, Sweet. Race leader, TK's got a lap card between him and the King of the Outlaws, Steve Kinzer. Blaney's still in third, so it's Americans. One, two and three. It is a great race out here at the moment at Valvoline Raceway.
way it's about to get fun. Oh no, Robbie Fardale bleeding. Max Dumsby. has gone flat right rear tyre. Left rear tyre is looking flat. Your race leader, his left rear, is looking flat. Hating's left rear. Tim Kading, your race leader, left rear is starting to go flat. We go back green. King of the Outlaws will be noticing that. Don't you worry about that. Ian Loudon trying to get a run. Toby Balboa, what's gone wrong with Toby? Car's not going where he wants it to go. Something steering on that car is not right on the Toby Balboa and Hawksworth Cafe. Kading, though, is out in front. Can the tyres hang on? Trevor Green is going to try and get He's up to third position. Gets a run on the out, King of the Outlaws. Trev trying to make this net red. Sour trash, Steve Kinzer. Tire, gone, yellow light. The King tries to get back to the pitch. Yellow light, yellow light. It's going to come down to tires, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, especially those fans up there right on the outside of turn four. The King is sitting there. It's the last time you're going to see him this summer. How about putting your hands together for the King of the Outlaws, Steve Kinzer! Craig Kinzer fifth. Brad Sweet behind him. We go back green racing with eight to go. You don't want to go too hard too early on these first few green laps. Keep an eye on what's happening. Scott Dolly Sprint Car Classic. TK. Still out in front. It's all about throttle control. Loudon's gone. Right rear gone on Ian Loudon. He's dusted. It's tire wear. It's all about tire wear. Loudon's not going to get back to the pitch. Yellow line. Six remaining. Let's get these six green flag flaps in. Trevor Green got a pretty good restart. Who's going to hang on? Sean Dobson going around the outside of Brad Sweet. Five remaining for TK. Anderson back there in third. Dobson's tyres just gone on the front straight. So can Dobson get back to the pits? Let's hope he can. Tim Kading, your race leader. His right rear's just gone. Race leader now is Trevor Green. Can the two routes drive us? Trevor Green, hang on for the win. Now through turns three and four. Anderson's in second. Trevor Green, he's gonna just pause it out there. He's got three to go for Trevor Green. Down the back straight. Trevor Green. Green Anderson back there in second spot. Spot is Craig Kinzer. You can see these guys. They're just throttle on the throttle. James Thompson's tyre is gone. It is a dead set tyre burner right now. Mark the goal for the two wheels driver. Trevor Green comes out of turn four. Sees the white lights flashing. He goes into turn one and two. Down the back straight. Let's stay green for Trevor Green. Down into turn three and four. Trevor Green takes out the Scott Darling Classic. Home in second spot goes Grant Anderson. Wow! Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Trevor Green climbing out of the race car. Now I do ask you, the race fans, to stay back. Trevor Green gives Scott's brother Luke Daly a big cuddle, gives his niece a kiss. John Boy, there's a checkered flag, Trevor Green.
You get up there, I'll get to you in a minute, don't worry. How about putting your hands together, ladies and gentlemen, for your 2014 Scott Daly Sprint Car Classic winner, Trevor Green!